Hey everybody, this is Jim, the Tabletop Engineer, and welcome to a new playthrough video. Today I am going to be playing another game of Alien Bug Hunt from Top Deck. Uh, I played this, I played it one time, I really enjoyed it, and today what I'm going to do is I'm going to be playing two different Marines. Um, this game has a lot going on, so I'm not really ready yet to... Um, to play it as a four-player game. I think two-player is perfect. I don't really need to be playing uh, four different characters. Um, I, I am curious as to how it plays with four, but two, two seems to be just enough to manage what's going on. So what I'm doing right now is just setting up the wounded tokens and the tracker, which starts there. I'm just gonna mix these up a little bit so I don't know which is which. Some of these have KIA on the other side, some are blank, so I don't know which is which. There we go. And I'm going to be playing Drake and Vasquez. Drake has a special ability. When Xenomorphs move into your tile, you can deplete him to shoot. And he has a, th a three shot, so he could, he could roll up to three dice to kill up to three aliens. Vasquez, her special ability is she gets plus two firepower while there are no xenomorphs in your tile. She's normally two, but then she gets plus two if there's no xenomorphs. And I guess that's the smart gun, like she can blast away in another tile. I've already randomized the tiles here. These are the dice. The only thing I have to do before we get playing is I have to pick my missions or randomize my missions. That's this deck right here. So I'm just going to shuffle it up a little bit and draw three scenarios or three missions that I have to accomplish to win the game. So we'll go one, two, and three. The rest of these can be set aside. I got install the sensor equipment, restart water pur purification, and secure the spaceport. This one, when I get three colonial tokens on it, activate at any time, move any squad to an adjacent tile. This one, activate at any time, remove up to two wounds on a character, all right? And this one, activate at any time, destroy up to three xenomorphs in a single tile that contains at least one squad. So those are pretty cool, I think. <laughs> Don't really know, I haven't played this enough. All right, Vasquez and Drake will start at the back. They have two grunts, so a grunt is at each point position. And we need to place the first alien. So I've already shuffled the tracking deck. I'll shuffle it again just for your benefit. Um, this is where you will place the initial uh, aliens. And let's go ahead and get it. Uh, it looks like three aliens are going to be placed at uh, number two. So you just take three dice. Each die represents one alien, and you put it here at sector two. I'm going to put it with the teeth up. might make it easier for you to see on the screen right here. Uh, there is no tile here, so we will uh, we'll get started. All right, so now what I need to do is I need to shuffle the phase deck. The phase deck has one Xenomorph card for each player. I'm playing two-handed, so there's two of these. It has a Lieutenant card, which has all the colors. And then it has three yellow and three red. Which The yellow corresponds to Drake, the red corresponds to Vasquez. These will tell me when they can take actions. You take this deck and you shuffle it up. And I'm going to just put it behind my back here and just shuffle it up a little bit. Uh, it's kind of hard to hand shuffle such a small amount of cards. All right, there we go. I'll just, and I'll cut it. I'll cut it once and then cut it twice. All right, there we go. So the first card to be revealed is the lieutenant card. Now the lieutenant card will let me choose either player. So I'm going to have Drake move here and reveal a tile. And the tiles have a flashlight on one of the four sides, and that that is placed where the character entering the tile for the first time is coming from. So it goes like this. This is barricaded, and these two are not. So for his second action, you can move and you can take one action. Your actions are shoot, capture an objective, breach a barrier, or reload. Well, I haven't shot. I can't shoot. You cannot shoot into a tile that isn't revealed. So I'm just going to put a breach icon here which means that there is free movement from here to here. It does not cost two. You get three movement points. 
it takes two or two to move through a, a barricade, one to move into a unbarricaded tile. And so his turn is done. Let's draw another card. We have a xenomorph. So, oh, so what this does, when that card shows up, you push the tracker up one. And when it gets to these green uh, circles here, the xenomorphs will attack and do other stuff. All right, draw again. Red. All right, so red is Vasquez. This time I'm going to have her move for one point, and then I'm going to have her move. Do I want to go ahead and engage these three? I probably do. I'm going to go ahead and have her move into here and reveal a tile. All right, so bad news for me. Good news and bad news. It, there's an objective token to grab, but there's two additional aliens. So I got to put two new dice in addition to the three that are there. Uh, they are in this tile. All right, five dice to roll. Now, Vasquez has two grunts that can each roll two dice, and that leaves one additional. So I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to burn them all. Six dice, which means I roll all five, and I can assign damage only to the point man, I believe. No, that's not true. Hold on. Let's go ahead and roll. Blanks go away. They get returned to the pool, and whites means no, no damage. Nothing happens, so they just stay put. And that is the end of her turn. Uh, they are depleted, by the way. So now we reveal. Okay, uh, she will move. You can always move away. From, if aliens are in your spot, you can always move out of that tile as long as you move into a tile that has a squad. So I'm moving back with Drake. And I am going to reload. And that's all I can do. Next card. Yellow, Drake. Drake needs to kill two aliens. Because this is breached, he can fire into that. So I will have both grunts fire. There are two shots each, so two bullets are getting wasted. And both aliens got killed. A blank means the alien gets killed. So that was good. And that is the end of that turn. Let's go again. Red. Let's move and take the objective. Where do I want to put it? I think I'm going to do activate at any time, destroy up to th three xenomorphs in a single tile that contains at least one squad. That's sort of a get out of jail card if I get swamped by aliens. So she is done. And next card is, bump this up. Next card is yellow. I will have... Have him move one, two. Now, why can he move here? Because there's no barricade there. So he moves here. There are three aliens in this spot. And there's an objective token. So he moved. Now he can choose to shoot. Well, the, the bad news for Drake is he's got two grunts depleted. But he, he's got three shots. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to choose to fire and roll all three of these. Ooh, bad news for me. The two red indicate that two damage was done, and that damage, I believe, is done to the person who shoots. So Drake uh, takes a wound. Actually, he takes two wounds. Uh, just that easy. All right, um, his turn is done. And uh, these were red, so he did not kill them. Um, right there. All right. And then the last card is his. Unfortunately, he is exhausted, so he will move out of these spots and then reload. And that is it. All right. This deck is depleted, so you shuffle it and you start all over. And what's going to happen is as the game progresses, it's going to get a lot more of these bad cards in it, the Xenomorph cards. You add one of those every time this track reaches the number nine, it gets added a card, and then it starts back here the next time you, uh, you pull a Xenomorph card. So, let's get going. Did I shuffle that good enough? I think I did. All right, let's see. 
All right, uh, the Lieutenant card. I'm going to have Vasquez. She gets plus two when she shoots into Xenomorphs that are not in her tile. So she will shoot at these two, and she is going to exhaust two, and she gets plus two, but it doesn't matter because I can only fire two, two aliens. One dies. Now, if you get the red and it's not in your squad, that means it moves in your direction, and you take no damage, but it moves. So there's that one. And she is done. Now Drake. Drake will move here. And I'm going to have one of his grunts fire at this one. And it kills it. All right. Easy enough. So Drake is done. Next card. Drake can go again. I am going to move. Oh. It takes two to move through this one. Okay. So he'll move here. And he reveals one alien. All right, so he's here, and there's an alien here with him. That's his turn. Vasquez will move here, and she will have one of her... Oh, you can't fire through a, a barricade. So she will breach that so that she can shoot into that next turn. And that is the end of her turn. Red. Now she will fire. One of the grunts will shoot at this one, and nothing happens. Um, that's her turn. Next. Ah, there we go. All right. Now we're at a green. So here's what happens. The Xenomorphs. They attack a squad with Xenomorphs in their tile. There's one here. It will do one damage, and the point man takes that damage. So the point man is him. Then, movement. All Xenomorphs will move one space towards the squad if they're adjacent, not diagonal. If they are not within adjacent of a squad, they will move towards this track. And if they reach this track, they escape and they don't go back in the pool, which is not good. You want to keep this full. Okay, um, and then you draw and resolve a spawn card. So we've got three at Sector 1. And we've got three at Sector 5. Okay. Now, next card. Yellow. All right. Uh, Drake will move here and fire because there's a breach now. Uh, what did I do? What are these for? Oh, these were there. Sorry. Uh, he will cause one of his grunts to fire. And fire at this one, and he kills it. All right, Drake's done. Red. Uh, Vasquez will, let's go here. She will move one and two more points to move through the barricade, which reveals this one. Oh, five aliens here. All right, she adds two more. Okay. Um, there is a, there's no objective here, so she is done. <laughs> she moved. She can fire. Hold on. Uh, Vasquez needs to reload. So she will reload. And that's it for her turn. And this should be an alien card. Yeah. So that pushes this up one. Now I shuffle. And we keep going. Yellow. Drake. Drake will move here for one, and he'll stop. Uh, do I want to stop? Yes. He'll stop, and he's going to reload. Next card. Good. Vasquez will move here, because remember, you can move into a squad tile, and she will shoot. She gets plus two. There's one, two, three. There's five. So I'm going to have a grunt. And her fire for a total of six firepower. So that means I can roll all the dice. Three dead, one nothing happens, and one alien moves towards me. And that is her turn. Red. Vasquez will... This... Hmm. I will... Uh, 
I'm going to move and fire at this one with this grunt. And I killed it. All right. Next card. Lieutenant. All right. Uh, I will have Drake go one, two. There's no barricade there. So he moves into this one, and there is nothing here. And for his action, he will breach here. Okay. And that's his turn. Okay, this moves up. Yellow, Drake again. All right, Drake. Uh, when Xenomorphs move into your tile, you can deplete Drake to have him shoot. I'm going to wait and see. Well, in two turns, these will move, not here, but they will move to Drake. When they do, he can immediately fire at them before they do any kind. When Xenomorphs move into your tile, you can deplete him to have him shoot at them. So I can shoot when they do the move phase. I think that's what I'm going to do. Uh, well, I did breach, so he is... Do I want to have him do anything? I'm going to have him... Well, he just moved, didn't he? The alien did, and then this one caused him to move here. No, no, no. I just drew that. So he... It's his turn. So he will... Do I want to have him move? I'm going to... I moved here, and that's all I can do. So... And I breached. So yeah, he's done. Sorry. Next card. Yellow. Him again. All right. I cannot fire into here because this tile is not revealed. So what I will do is I will breach here so that I can move there into sector four if I had to. I don't, it doesn't, you don't have to do that. Never mind. Um, aliens move for free. I can only move into sector three, so never mind. Um, I am going to, <laughs> if I move here, I do have time to get back. All right, so I'm going to move here and reveal a tile, and there's nothing in there. And that was one, and for two, uh, that's all you can do. You can, when you move into a tile, that's all you can move. And then I'm going to breach here, and his turn is done. Next card. <sighs> she is going to pick up the... She's not going to move. Actually, hold on. Uh, she needs to reload. She'll reload, and she's done. Next card should be the alien. Yep. All right, that pushes this up, and we shuffle again. All right, red, okay. This time I'm going to have her pick up the objective and put it... Activate, remove up to two runs on any character. I might, I might do that to Drake in a moment. So she is done. She gets to do again. Um, let's... I really need them to stay together, but I'd really like to investigate here. So we're going to investigate there. We're going to move. There's one alien here and one objective token. So she moves, and I'm going to have a grunt fire at that alien, and it kills it. All right. Next card. Her again. All right. Uh, this time she'll... Does she want to move? She could barricade here. She, she's going to breach here so she can fire into their next turn. That's her turn. Anybody can fire, move. All right, let's have her... Let's have her shoot that one. She will have a grunt fire at it. And she kills it. All right. Yellow. All right, let's do it. Um, he is going to move here. And that is a free move. All right, excellent. And he will breach here. Um, the next time they activate, these will move into here because I'm adjacent. All right, so next card. There we go. So this moves up. 
attack squads with xenomorphs in their tiles. No xenomorphs are in my tile. These will move one space. They move here. Drake will, Drake will uh, exhaust and fire three bullets. He killed two, but unfortunately he took one damage. Ugh. I'm going to go ahead and use uh, this. I'm going to flip it over to the X side to take two wounds off of Drake. Shuffle these up a little bit. Okay. And Drake's turn is, uh, well, that was the alien's move. Then you spawn. Oh, man. One, two, three, four, five are going to spawn in that very first one. Ah, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Right there. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and use this token to remove three of those. Do I want to do that? Do I want to do that? Because they're not going to they're not going to run. Yeah, so I do. So because they're going to attack Drake. So I'm going to kill all three of them, and that leaves two here and one here. All right. Next card, or that was the that was this, and I spawned. All right. Now next card, yellow Drake will move here. Oh, he can't because there's no squad there. He will have to have one of his grunts. I'm going to have this one fire at this. And I killed it. Very good. And that's all he can do. Yellow. Um, I really need to reload. He's done. Didn't move. And then last bumps this up, which adds one of these cards here. And now there's three in there, and now it's time to shuffle. All right, first card. Ah, bump this up. So when it wraps around, it triggers the attack. There are none in my in here. These two will move here, and then we reveal a tracker. Four here. Come on. One, two, three, four. I need to get Vasquez over here. All right. My turn. Flip a card. Yellow. Um, he will... I can't move with aliens in, so I have to fire. I will have this grunt fire two. Oh, and he takes two damage. Ah. One and two. All right, Drake is done. Red, I'm going to have her pick this up and put it on remove three xenomorphs again, and she is done. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and use it. It says use it any time, and I'm going to remove three of these out here. All right, next card. we got to bump this up one. All right, next card. Anybody, I'm going to have her move one, two, three and she is that's her move and she will reload this bumps up one yellow um drake and i'm gonna have this grunt fire too and one dies and one takes a wound or he takes a wound so both grunts are at two out of four damage. Uh, next card. Red. Vasquez is going to go one. And then she will fire at this one. She'll have one of her grunts fire. She does not get the plus two, only she does. But the grunt's firing here. There is no barricade. So I get to roll this, and I killed it. All right, her turn is done. Yellow. Uh, Drake is going to move here for one to go ahead and reveal it. Ah, two aliens and a, and a uh, colonial token. So two plus the one that's already there. And he, he moved, and I guess now he will he'll shoot. Actually, hold on. Well, the next time I draw a bug hunt card, which I believe is that one, it's going to trigger attacks. 
So he might as well go ahead and, and shoot. I'll have him shoot all three. They all three die. Excellent. All right. Um, he's that was him. Next card it should be an A. Oh no, it's red. Okay. So Vasquez is, is going to. I'd like to stay near the middle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go one, two, three to move through this barricade. And there's nothing there. All right. And she's done. So I'm going to have her breach here to make it easier to for Drake to come to her. Um, uh, that's it for the deck. All right. So shuffle up. Draw a card. Red. All right. Let's keep exploring. Um, she's going to go here. One alien. No objective tokens. All right. So she's here. And because I know that the next time I draw an alien card, this one's going to attack, I'll go ahead and have this grunt shoot to hopefully kill it. And he does. All right. Um, that is her turn. There we go. This triggers. There are no aliens to attack or move, so we go straight to the tracking phase. One lone alien appears here. Nice. I got lucky there. Check out the new RPG and Wargame newsletter. Each week, the tabletop engineer shares news, products, Kickstarters, and much more related to the gaming hobby. It's free to subscribe, so check out the link in the video description below to sign up. Okay, next card. Yellow. Uh, Drake, he, he will have to reload. He can't do anything else. Uh, next card. Yellow. Okay, now he will fire. This grunt will fire at this one. And he kills it. So Drake is done. Next card. Bump this up one. Next card. Yellow. Drake will take this objective token and put it on the heal two wounds, and I'm going to go ahead and use it to take two off of my point grunt. And that is that. Okay, next card. Red. What do I do here? Let's keep exploring. Let's go one. Let's go here. Ah, good. Two aliens and a colonial token. Alright, she's here. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have to shoot at them right now. That's good. So I'm going to leave them be, and I'm going to take the token uh, and put it... Um, activate, move any squad to an adjacent tile. I'm going to still put it here to get rid of three xenomorphs whenever I need it. It'll be there. All right, she's done. She can go again. Well... I guess I will have her reload. And now I will have one of her grunts fire. Killed one and the other one, nothing happens. This should be an alien card. Yep, that pushes it here. Now we have to shuffle. All right, let's see. Ah, push up. Oop. Now, <laughs> there is an alien to attack. It attacks the point man for one damage. Then you move. There are no aliens to move. This one stays because it's already there. And then you reveal a tracking. One will go here. One at four, which will go there. And you always place them where these hive circles are. Uh, up to that number. And then one will go here. All right. That's that. Draw another card. Red. Vasquez. She will have this grunt shoot at this one. Nothing. Red. She will have... She will... You get plus two when there are no xenomorphs in your tile. Unfortunately, I'm just going to reload. Alright, here we go. Uh, this grunt will shoot at this one. Kills it. And that's all I can do. I'm gonna have uh, I'm gonna have Drake go one, two, and he will then fire at this one with his own 
uh, gun. He gets to fire up to three dice. He does not do anything. Uh, oh, this adds another one of those. Red. All right. Uh, this grunt will fire at this one. Kills it. And last card. No, one more card. Yellow. Uh, he will shoot. Well, he'll have to reload. He has to reload. And then next card is yellow. All right. Now he will fire at this one. And nothing happens. All right. Uh, shuffle this up. Keep going. Yellow. This grunt will fire. Nothing. Man. Alien. All right. We trigger the Xenomorph. This does not attack anybody. It moves one space. I will have it move towards um, Vasquez. Uh, then we spawn. Actually, this one, since there's nobody here, it will move here, which this dice goes away. I can't do anything uh, about it. It, it, will, it doesn't go back in the pool. All right, we have two here, and we have one here, and we place one here. The reason that, the, oh, no, I'm sorry. Both go there. Two and two. All right. Uh, this goes away. Reveal a card. Great. This is where the game starts ramping up. Um, red. I will fire this grunt here. Kills it. Good. Uh, next card, yellow. He is going to go one, two, three. Nothing. That's okay. Next card. Oh, uh, then he can reload. Next card. Anybody. Um, Drake will move here for two to make through that. And he's going to fire at these two. Uh, I'm going to have this grunt fire both of these. And nothing, but this one moves towards me. All right. Now Drake will have this grunt fire at this one. Kills it. And then red. She is going to move here for two. Good. A colonial token. All right. Uh, here, and there are two here. I'm going to, I am going to activate and destroy up to three in a single tile that contains at least one squad. I'm going to hold on to that. When two dice move out, um, that's two dice you do not get back. Oh, and I forgot, when one moves off, this increases by one. Sorry, so we're one step closer. Um, all right, hopefully this is not an alien card, but I'll bet it is. It is. So now we are here. These move off. Uh, during the move phase, they will. This one will, uh, will, these two will attack. And they hit the grunt. This one moves, and then we do a spawn. Number three, one alien at number three, which goes right here. Red, she will fire two dice. Kills them both. So she's done. And then, an alien card. Boom. Shuffle. Yellow. Uh, Drake will fire at... Do I want to fire? I don't need to. I will fire at this one. And nothing happens. All right. Next card. Boop. Next card. Yellow. Drake will reload. Everybody reloads. All right. Anybody. Uh, I'm going to have uh, Vasquez pick this up and put it on here. And I'm going to have her heal two wounds on her grunt. Mix these up a little bit. Uh, that's her turn. 
red. All right, now she needs to, we need to find one, two, three, three more tokens, three more colonial tokens. All right, let's go here. Nothing but one alien. All right, and she moved, and I will have her reload. This time, she will have her grunt shoot at this one, and nothing happens. Bump. All right, anyone in a, in a, all right, so this one hits Drake, his grunt. This one hits this grunt. Uh, movement, um, this one will move into here, and then we spawn. Oh, a whole bunch. Two at two. Two at three, which is one and here, and then two at four, which is here and here. Okay, um, let's see. Yellow. Drake will fire, a grunt will fire at these two, and they both get killed. Excellent. Um, and he, then the next card is bump we add another card to this and then red all right um vasquez vasquez will fire at this one nothing happens all right that's it shuffle the deck all right yellow that he will move one, two, three. Actually, no, one, and then he'll breach. One, and he'll breach. Ah. Uh, uh, all right, anyone in a squad, will, this one attacks her, so her grunt now has three. And now, movement. These two move off, so I don't get it, and that bumps this up one. This one is not adjacent, so it will move here. This one will move here. This one will move here. And this one will move here. All right. Uh, red. Vasquez is going to move into... Well, she'll move into here, and she'll reload. Good. And now she gets plus two firepower while there are no xenomorphs. She will fire at both of these. Actually... Doesn't really matter. I can fire this grunt. I'll have this grunt fire. One dies and the other one stays there. All right. Next card. She will. She will fire this time. And kills it. All right. Next card. Bump. Next card. Um, I need three more. So we got to explore. Um, he will move. Who, who is it? I'm gonna have. Drake move here. There we go. Two aliens and a token. And now uh, Drake moved and he will they're going to attack him the next time it advances. So he is going to he's going to have to fire. He'll fire three bullets so he can fire both of these. Oof, one gets killed, but one one damages him. All right, um, draw another card. Bump, attack. This will attack his point man. Uh, movement, this one will move out, so it's gone. This one moves here, this one moves here. And then we draw a tracker card. Three go in two, so that's one, two, three. Three go into three, which is one, two, three, and three go into four. Uh, one, two, three. All right. Yep. Man, I'm getting swamped here. Okay. Uh, oh, man. Okay. Oh, come on. Yellow. Yellow will move here, and this grunt will fire at this one. Oh, I needed to get that token. I, I'll go get it. All right, he kills it. All right. Um, next card, hopefully. All right, I will move and reload. That's it. 
All right, this game is going to start wrapping up fast. The game ends when I have no more dice to roll or this goes out, which is unlikely. All right, red. Red, we need to find these tokens. All right, so she's going to go one, two, one, two, three, and reveal this one. Nothing. All right, but one alien. All right. So she moved, and I'll have this grunt fire at her, fire at it, and it kills her. All right, so that's done. Next card. She will move here. Good. One alien and one colonial token. We've got two left. She moves here, and she'll have to reload. She cannot fire. Next. She, <laughs> uh, this grunt will fire at this one and kills it. All right. Um, next card. Alien. Boom. Next card. Alien. Xenomorph, attack. There are no aliens in my spot. Move. These two move off, and that bumps this up one, which adds a card. This moves here. This moves here, here. This one moves off, which bumps this to here, and I add a card. Actually, no, I don't add a card. I just It just advances that. Um, and then this one moves here, that there, and that there. Man, okay. Um, then I spawn three at two, one, two, three. You can fill them up to that number max. That's how many will appear there. And then three at three, which is one, two, three. They're just swapping the facilities, what they're doing. Okay, we got to wrap this up. Um, I need one more token. All right. Oh, come on. Uh. All right, he will pick this up, and it says, activate it any time to move to an adjacent tile. I will do it and move him here. <laughs> All right, uh, next is alien card. Oh, this is bad. Okay, um, attack, there are none. Move, these move off, this bumps up, moves over, bumps up. This one moves up, bumps up. Boom, 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 boom. I'm running out of alien dice very quickly. This is what ends the game. All right. Uh, yellow, come on. Um, I'm going to have to shoot. Drake will shoot. When, when you are, when, when Xena works, you can deplete Drake to have him shoot. All right, Drake will shoot three at these. Killed them both. Excellent. All right, he's done. He'll shoot two at these two. Killed one, and then this one moves here. And then this one will fire at this one and kills it. All right. Shuffle. The game is wrapping up. I only need... I only need... Uh, I need... I need two more tokens. Two more. All right, bad. Uh, attack, nobody, move, off, off, that bumps this up, one, and then two, which triggers, th these move, and then this triggers these to move again. Bump, bump. All right, uh, red, she picks up this, and then we'll use it to move one here, one movement, one tile. Oh no, I need one more token. I, she'll move here. She'll move here. And nothing. I need one more stinking. All right, uh, she'll move here for two. Nothing but one alien. And she'll fire at this one. And she kills it, all right. That bumps this up, which triggers an attack. There's nobody, nobody to move, and then I spawn. Three at four. One, two, three, and then three at five. One, two, three. When there's when you run out of these, you put the dice at the next open space. 
All right, there's only like five dice left. My turn. Yellow. He needs to get to the get here. So he's going to go one, two, three, and he'll breach. And he's done. That bumps this up. That bumps this up. He'll go one, two, and he'll fight. Oh, he'll reload. He'll reload. Hopefully, I can kill these. Uh, next card. Anybody. Um, I need one more. She'll go here. Nothing. Next card. Yellow. He will shoot into here with this grunt, and he kills one, and this moves into my space. Red will sh reload. Because I need to, well, do I, no, hold on. I'll have this grunt fire at these two, and they're dead. All right, next card moves this up, and next card moves this up, which triggers the attack. There, This one will attack his point man. He's got three on it. This one moves here. This one moves here. And then we, uh, then we draw a card. Three go in one. One, two, three, and then three go in five. One, two, three. Okay, uh, Vasquez, please draw me something. You've got to find that token. All right. Of course. Boom, add another one. Oh, add it to the discard. Red, okay. Move... Here. Got it. Found the token. All right. So, but there's two aliens here, and there's only two dice left. And there is a token, and this is the last one. If I can get that and then get her home, I win. She cannot shoot at these, however, so she will reload. She moved, and now she'll reload. Draw a card, which triggers... Oh, uh, this is not good. So, the bad news for me is I lose, because... Uh, they attack. This one attacks and kills. This Well, this grunt now has four wounds on him. Then this one moves. This one, this one. These two move off, which forces this up. These two move up, which forces that. And then this one moves here. But then when I draw a tracking, I have no dice to place. And that is a condition of the lost game. That was still fun. It was so close. All I needed was this token. There are ten of these, and you only need nine. This was just an extra. But one token and then to get her out and I would have won. Oh well. <laughs> Alright, this is Aliens Bug Hunt, a very fun game. I hope you enjoyed watching me play it. Um, I'll put a link to where you can get your own copy of it down below in the video description. This is Jim the Tabletop Engineer. Thanks for joining me as I played another game of Aliens Bug Hunt. I'm going to play again very soon, so keep your eyes open. Until then, everybody, take care.